Each of you will, re will receive a teddy bear pattern in class with the teddy bear and the different pieces of the teddy bear attached. So you have the bear's foot pads, the inner ears, and the muzzle as well. The first step is to cut out the teddy bear pattern and the different pieces that go along with the bear. So you're going to take a piece of a uh, pair of scissors and start to cut out the teddy bear. So I'll start that here. First I'm going to cut my teddy bear. Now notice that there are dotted lines around the teddy bear. That is where you'll be cutting. Okay, those are your cutting lines. So I'm going to start cutting along the dotted lines. Okay, so you're going to carefully cut all the way around the teddy bear. Okay, making your way. along the dotted lines. Trimming it down. I'll show you what the pattern looks like once the bear is completely cut. So this is the teddy bear pattern once it's fully cut. So notice I cut along the dotted lines. The dark black lines are still intact. Now we're going to move on to cutting the pieces to the teddy bear. So that's the second part of the cutting process. So now I'm going to be cutting all the bear pieces. Uh, notice that there are also dotted lines to cut on. So I'm going to take my scissors and start cutting out each piece of the bear. I'm cutting along the dotted lines. Here are all of our bear pieces, so our two inner ears are cut, the two bear's foot pads are cut, and the muzzles. So I cut around the dotted lines and now I have um, some space in between. That's going to be very important when we're pinning down the bear pieces. Now you'll choose two pieces of felt for the teddy bear. One piece of felt will be for the front of the teddy bear. The second piece of felt is going to be for the back of the teddy bear. You're going to be pinning the teddy bear pattern onto both pieces of felt, one at a time. Notice on the bear pattern, there are X's with the word pin marked on the pattern. That's where you'll be putting each straight pin to pin the bear down to the felt. I'll show you how to do that. You're going to lay the teddy bear down horizontally. You're going to take a straight pin and take the straight pin to pin the bear down where each X is. To pin the bear down properly, you're going to take the pin, go through the pattern, and go through the felt. And then you need to bring the point of the pin back up to poke it through. Okay, that's one. You're going to do that again. Take the pin, poke the pin through the X so it goes through the pattern and the felt. You're going to bring the pin point back up and through. Just like so. Okay, now the head is pinned down. We're going to continue to pin the arms and the foot pads down to the felt. When the pins look correct, they'll look like staples on the back of the felt. 
So we're going to continue pinning the arms and the foot pads down. Here we have the teddy bear fully pinned down. So the arms are pinned, the foot pads are pinned, the ears are pinned. Everything's pinned correctly because the pins look like staples on the back. And now we're ready to start cutting out the bear's shape. You're going to take a pair of scissors and now you're going to cut along the black thick line. So I'm going to start from the top, start cutting on the black line all the way around. The best way to use the scissors is to bring the felt into the blade. So I'm pulling the felt into the blade of the scissors. It's going to make it a lot easier to cut. So I'm going to work my way all the way around cutting the teddy bear. Okay, as you can see. You'll see what it looks like once I'm done cutting. So we've cut all the way around the teddy bear and now we're going to remove the pattern. So you'll take the pins out, place them back on the pin cushion, the pin, take that out, take this pin, last pin and you'll take this pattern and pin it onto your second piece of felt that way you'll have two pieces for the bear okay once you cut out the second piece you'll have a front and a back of the bear